Cura provides reports, which give real-time executive decision support in the form of interactive dashboards. Cura's GRC platform features powerful dashboards and reporting capabilities that streamline the information sharing process through creating powerful visualizations of the solution data. In terms of self-service dashboards, here we see examples of dashboards created for various solutions such as litigation, ISO 31000, currency, BCM, maps and many more. To show you how easy it is to create these dashboards and perform analysis, we are going to create a new dashboard. For the purposes of this exercise, we will name the dashboard Gartner. The dashboard we create can be used for our own private analyses, or it can be shared with our team or made public for all users of Cura. When creating a report, we select the data we will be reporting on. In this case, we are selecting a risk register. Cura has a number of reporting types. In this example, we are going to pull our risk data onto a heat map. To do this, we select the heat map option. We can then select what we would like plotted onto the heat map. In this case, we are going to plot the consequence rating on the x-axis and on the y-axis the likelihood rating. In the second report, we are going to expand on the data displayed in the heat map by visualizing the risk control effectiveness rating in the form of a donut chart. If we select the risks on the heat map, for example the top five risks, it will display the risk control effectiveness rating of these five risks in the corresponding donut chart. We would now like to see what the risks we are working with in these two graphs are. To do this, we are going to add a detailed grid view. We are going to select the same data source, select a grid chart, and we are going to make this an editable grid chart by selecting the Is Editable Grid checkbox. This will allow us to update the risk data within the report. If we now select risk data in the heat map or any of the other graphs on the page, it will update the corresponding graphs. In this case, we can now see the risk names for the risks we have selected in the heat map. We have the option to export this report to PDF. If we want to navigate to the risk in detail within the risk register, we can click on the risk name within the detailed view. We can now view the risk in its full workflow. It can be updated, re-rated, or have additional actions and tasks added into it. From here, we can create a screenshot by selecting the camera button. This will allow us to make notes on any important data and share. Other examples of dashboards within Cura include some of the following.